Look at the camera. You don't want to look. You don't want to look. This Mr. Man, y'all. This one of the cats that I was telling you about. This my orange cat. He always keep his hands in my shirt. I don't know why. He don't want to look at the camera now. Mister, don't you want to see? Look at your people. They love animals. You know that? You want to leave? You don't want the people to see you? Look. There you go. Look. <laughs> he petty. He petty. Maybe girlfriend will come. Let's see. Because he want to run. Let's see. He go girlfriend. Girlfriend, look, see, look, she a star. She not hating. Look, girlfriend, say hey, America, and people over the world. Say hey. You see them out there? Crazy, crazy. Hey, look, now Mr. trying to get back up here. I'm not finna keep playing with y'all. They so extra. These cats, both of them. I um actually got them from one of my cousins. And she brought them over because they was the last two that survived from the litter. It was eight of them, and the rest of them passed. And I think they got pneumonia. It was really sad. But they're still here. So I'm glad. I had to adopt both. I really wanted Mister because he was orange. He kind of reminded me of one of my old cats named Yin <laughs> My allergies, y'all know how I go. And I don't like to take medication at all. Okay, shout out to my mama for getting me the nice setup with the lights to hold the phone, okay? I appreciate that. I'm still trying to figure out how to set up my green screen. So what y'all got going on today? It's Friday night. It's time to turn up. I love life still to this day. Shout out to everybody that has been on my channel. I got quite a few new subscribers. Thank you so much. The most recent one was Diesel the God. I appreciate you, bro. Thank you so much. You the best. And I definitely want y'all to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell so y'all can see what I'm doing. I definitely want you to still stay in tune with me. And of course, now they making noises, knocking down my cups and stuff off the table. I don't know why cats gotta be so disrespectful. Like dogs, they literally wanna please you. They wanna make sure that you're happy with them. They'll do whatever you say, not cats. They act like you literally, like they own you or you they master. Like, I don't get it. What type of stuff do y'all cats do? Like, am, do I, am I the only one with cats that I disrespectful and mean? Like, I, they literally understand everything I tell them. Like, when I get them they temptations, shout out to temptations because I don't know what y'all be putting in them trees, but these cats be tripping out, and they literally know a bad name. It's insane. But every time I get them temptations, and I like to toss him so I could distract Mister because he's such a bully that he'll come over and eat girlfriend's temptations and then try to go and eat his. So I have to throw his so he have to hunt for him and search for him while I give her hers, girlfriend hers on the side. It's trippy. Like, I don't understand what's going on with them and Mr. being a bully, but I guess it's because he orange. And I know that orange cats definitely have attitude problems, okay? It's tripped out. So what do y'all cats be doing? Like, are my cats the only ones that's crazy? And I tell him, hey, go over there. Go get your temptations. And then he'll listen. He'll do it. But when I tell him to get out of my kitchen or don't go in my room, because that's the two places that's off limits for them, the kitchen and my room. Because when they was kittens, they knocked down every single bottle of perfume off my dresser and broke some nice stuff so they can no longer come in my room. Period. It's over with. It is what it is. But they got the rest of the house. I know y'all see this condo behind me. It's got like eight floors. Come on now. They, they don't need to be in my room for nothing. But they definitely do whatever they want to do, so whatever. What what do y'all cats do? Y'all cats nice to y'all? I do appreciate their presence being here because I live next to a field. And you know, in the wintertime, those mice try to come in your house. They so disrespectful. They just slide under the door like a letter, <laughs> even though they have a mouth. And it's gross. I can't stand them. So please comment below, like, and share. I'll be coming back soon. Have a good night, y'all.